In 2000 or 2001, New Belgium reached a size where the city started noticing an impact on their wastewater treatment facility. We started paying them an additional amount to treat our waste stream. So we've always had that passion to keep pumping into these efforts of how can we be better? How can we create less of an impact? And how can we make resources out of our waste? New Belgium got into process wastewater treatment for a couple of reasons. Either we were going to take care of this wastewater treatment or we were going to be paying the city to do that. So at that point we decided to take that investment, invest in our own infrastructure, and that's when New Belgium got into the process wastewater treatment business. The wastewater that we're treating is processed wastewater, so it's the wastewater created by the beer making process. Underneath us is a large basin kept oxygen free, so we have bacteria that thrives in an oxygen deprived environment, consumes the pollutants or contaminants in the wastewater, and the byproduct given off is a methane rich biogas. As the biogas is being created by our anaerobic digester, it's stored in this large white balloon behind me until the balloon reaches capacity. Then we send the biogas up to the brewery and it's burned in our combined heat and power unit or our co-generator. New Belgium reuses a lot of materials around the breweries. We have a lot of office furniture made from old bowling alleys or sawdust or cardboard rolls. You'll see chairs made out of old bicycle rims. So one of the reasons that a lot of us work here at New Belgium is because of our commitment to the environment. Oh, and a free case of beer a week. <laughs>